Imagine a phone that comes to life when you touch it, that grows with you, that lets you carry all your friends with you. become something different when you need it. That can be as simple as you want it to be. Or as complex. Stop imagining. Communication is about people, not about devices. It is about you communicating easily with your friends. It is about finding all of them in your phone. Communication is also personal, and as different as people can be. This phone has been designed for making communication easier among so many different people. When you touch your phone, your fingerprint is recognized and your biometric profile loaded. Now your data stays with you, safe and accessible anytime, anywhere. Once you've loaded your profile, you're ready to communicate. Instead of having a list with applications, you can now directly find your contacts in the primary interface. Your friends are distributed in networks and levels based on frequency of communication and relationships. Once you find the person you want, just click on them, and all the possible ways you have to communicate with them are displayed, just as it should be, as easy as in real life. The usage of the phone and the display of info have been optimized through a new 3D interface. Advanced Java programming mapped onto a 3D scenario is used to create a tree interface which prioritizes the information. Just climb the branches by dragging and explore a better way to interact with electronic devices. The 3D interface is combined with weak artificial intelligence to achieve a more intuitive device. The phone interprets your behavior and rearranges the interface so the options or contacts you use the most appear on the first level leaving what you don't use often in the last branches, visible only when you look for them. The artificial intelligence is also used for growing the software on your phone. Through genomic classification of software, your phone automatically downloads applications you might like or use, or that your friends are already using, keeping you in touch with the most effective way of communication. The result is a totally customized phone that has only what you want. What if you had a phone that could grow buttons? Or a phone that could feel your touch and then come to life? Or a phone that your friends could jump right out of? To make communication easier and more natural, a radical change in the relationship between the user and the device was required. Making technology become obvious obscures this relationship. What is needed is something appealing, natural, organic, and simple. The design recalls the idea of a blank canvas, a neat surface that shows you the technology when you need it and invites you to use it. Its innovative 3D touchscreen allows anything to be displayed on it in three dimensions. For instance, buttons can be grown at user's choice. Physical feedback is also given. Whenever you interact with your phone, it will magically morph providing a new dimension in electronic interactivity. For the first time, you can literally feel an electronic device. To use your phone, just grab it. Your fingerprint will be recognized and your personal profile loaded. You will feel it through a subtle three-dimensional ripple in the screen, as if you had instilled into it a part of you.
Navigating through the interface is now easier and more intuitive. Just pass your finger around. The screen will bump out to create a magnifying glass effect, allowing you to see the options embedded in the main elements of the interface. When you click, the screen bumps in. When you put your fingers away, the screen flattens again. Natural gestures that allow better communication between you and your device. To communicate with a friend, just pass your finger above his name and all options will appear when the screen bumps out. All the ways to contact that person appear. Just click on them. Any application can be configured to your choice. For instance, you can program your phone so it grows a standard keyboard when held horizontally. or a writing recognition pad when held vertically. This phone is able to grow itself. For instance, if one of your friends wants to communicate with you via a medium you're not familiar with, the phone alerts you with a subtle undulation in its screen. You can choose whether to accept it or not. If you accept, the medium will become available on your phone. Now, you can communicate with your friend easier. The screen's 3D morphing is achieved using a combination of advanced nanotechnology and optical transmission methods. Nanofiber optics configure the seamless surface of the screen. Each of their extremes creates a nanopixel of the high-resolution image. The other extreme of each fiber optic is coated with a conductive metal and embedded in a nano rack, which is also conductive. The vertical movement of the fibers is achieved by the transmission of controlled opposite magnetic charges from the rack to the coating. In 10 years' time, nanotechnology will be mass producible, and this foam will be a reality. Today, it is only possible on a much larger scale, and not yet applicable to consumer electronic devices.